personally, it's been such a, an adventure and such a joy to discover these pieces by Chrysler and Korngold and um, just getting to know uh, this extraordinary repertoire that actually nobody really knows. It's really fun and exciting to get them out there and, and um, have them on CD so people can listen to them. I like to think of these uh, pieces, especially the Korngold Quartet, as a kind of journal of what was going on with him emotionally. He hadn't written anything for uh, seven years that wasn't film music, and he was actually able to use these uh, little pieces of film music that he had written for Warner Brothers in this quartet. And I think it's especially moving that this is the first piece of so-called real music. It was not for film that he wrote in seven years, and it was at the end of the war. And he gave this quartet as a present to his wife for Christmas 1945. The, the Chrysler and the Korngold are both pieces that were the result of deep periods of crisis. Um, Chrysler served as a soldier in World War I and was injured, and so he had a period of really not being a violinist. And I think coming out of this pandemic, although of course it's a very different experience, but we all have the sense of having lived something else and having been something other than musicians. And it's a real joy to us now to come back together and play this amazing music and, and really, really appreciate what it is that music gives us. So I've always had a very soft spot for um, kind of entertaining music, things that are a bit schmaltzy, um, Wienerisch, all those kind of sounds. These two pieces are really, really interesting in that they are a very interesting combination of those kind of sounds, those kind of passages, and very serious music with a lot of depth to it. So it's kind of two worlds that come together in these pieces also. As a quartet, we've studied these pieces for quite a while, and it's marvelous music, and uh, there's really nothing, I think, that um, uh, we like to do better than to rehearse and uh, explore such, uh, such beautiful pieces. And uh, the COVID crisis came and uh, we couldn't do it, we couldn't record, it was delayed several times. But I think this recording uh, will always mark for us as artists, hopefully the end of a very, very difficult time in our lives. <laughs>